play up, play up. Yeah. <laughs> Get your pimp phone out, nigga. Stop playing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, damn, I ain't got no rebuttal for that. <laughs> Yo, fuck, we ain't got nobody. Come on, you Chosen. You know we love to hear your voice. What's, what's up, Chosen? Shit. Yeah, yeah. I, oh, what do you guys I want mean? you to read, we boo boo. Somebody to read the top statement, and that's coming from the district attorney about the P. Diddy oh. and the, uh, what he did to Cassie, how he kicked her and woke her, knocked her out, and they woke her back up with a swift kick to the forehead. That shit was vicious. I ain't going to tell you. Keep it G. When you do shit like that. Oh, that's some shit I didn't did to an enemy out there. I knocked yeah, him out. Kick him in the shit. head that's and shit. Yeah, when you kick damn. him, you knock him out and then kick oh, him Oh, damn. This is my type of shit. Okay, so it says, oh, statement on alleged video involving Sean Combs. We are aware of the video that has been circulating online, allegedly depicting Sean Combs assaulting a young woman in Los Angeles. We find the images extremely disturbing and difficult to watch. If the conduct depicted occurred in 2016, unfortunately, we would be unable to charge as the conduct would have been would have occurred beyond the timeline where a crime of assault can be prosecuted. As of today, law enforcement has not presented a case related to the attack depicted in the video against Mr. Combs, but we encourage anyone who has been a victim or witness to a crime to report it to law enforcement or reach out to the to our office for support from our Bureau of Victim Services. And this is in from Los Angeles County District Attorney's Office, May 17, 2024. Oh, so he he skated. He skated on the as back as far as Oh, the limitations. I want to know why it took so long for that shit to come out. That's bullshit. Because, man. I mean, I, you know how it goes, man. They play, yeah, they, but they, fuck it's, that. It's, that's it's the dirty shit, politics. Well, that's it's ugly. That's it's bad dirty bad politics word. involved now. So, um, But now they're going to be combing through everybody that's had fucking Sean Combs at their fucking establishment. Anybody that's so. They're going through every place he's been, every hotel they've been in. Every They're going through all the fucking footage. So... If he did that shit recently, within I think I think it's a year and one day they have to file. Oh yeah, they definitely gonna look for some recent shit. If something recent like that, he, he he can get he, he in enough. I mean, hey. But his but his ex had an um, interview with a person that I shall not name, and she stated you shouldn't her, be her able to do all this if you can't say, change your PTR. Hello. No. What's the purpose of the conversation? Excuse me. It's gonna be surviving Diddy. And so what we got going on here is a, oh. After that video came out, you gonna see so a lot. Why are we so focused on me? I, I, I didn't change there, Jay. After that, after that <laughs> video come out, it's gonna be a, after this gonna be a lot of shit coming out. No, I can tell you that. Well, I hope that shit come out before that fucking limitation shit is up. That shit need to come out now. Fuck that. That's probably going to be a lot of content. Everything that they can't use all the way up to what they can. Yeah, so like I was saying, this girl named Gina, his ex, has stated that he hit her, beat her up, did the same exact thing that he did on that video um, to Cassie. And she had said it in an interview. Um, and again... There's people that have stated that he abused or touched them, but nothing was done. That was years ago, though, right? No, she just did this interview not but that long ago. But when did she say it happened, though? Who? Gina? Gina. I, I don't want to play the... It, it's an interviewer that we don't fuck with. Yeah, I, I don't but how, I'm just saying, how long ago did she say it happened? Probably like two, like, like two or a year. Two, mm. two, something like that. Maybe around COVID time, if I'm not mistaken. That was a couple years ago. That's why I told you. Yeah, it's his ex. He had a baby with her, but she ended up getting an abortion. Or, boom, she was good. She got an abortion. But yeah. But the same exact thing that you seen in the video was the same exact thing that she just uh, um, described that he did to her, actually. Like, he beat her, he beat her side, her head, um, but he just didn't want to touch her face. Like, he did. He beat her, beat her up everywhere else but her face. That's fucked up. Yeah, definitely fucked up. Definitely fucked up. 
And so and I, I would like, I mean, he, uh, Puffy knows what he's done and whether or not it's possibly recorded or not. But with all these people and all these like reports and all these locations to where these things have happened and based on like his character from what I've seen, how he acts online, like I would think that there has to be some more footage coming out soon. If you're just like in hotels and all over oh, just see. beating up women and touching on men and doing all this stuff like yeah, a lot of shit's, a lot of shit's gonna come out. It, whole shit. After seeing that, it makes you think of that Wale shit is uh, real. And you handle bang them up over roof and shit like that. All right, so I got a question. If uh, Diddy would have got charged, should Solange should have got charged for beating up Hove in the uh, elevator? Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, Ray Rice did. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Not too much on Solange. No, but I think the person has to charge so a lot of times. But the DA and, and can and pick again, that oh, up, I, bro. I was about I was about to say that, but alone, I think that they don't take that shit seriously when women hit on men like that, though. That's real. I, nigga, I threw a water bottle at the fucking tow truck driver. Nigga, they charged me with assault. Four one five. Yeah, they take it seriously when I do it. Hey, don't come around me. I don't, I don't need you putting your hands on me. How big was the water bottle? Was it like a gallon? <laughs> it definitely was a gallon, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Start with a gallon out of niggas wild. <laughs> I knew it was a gallon with your ass. Hey, bro. You tried to sleep. That nigga with that shit. Right through the window. <laughs> <laughs> Get his ass out of here. I was like here. 19 years old, Hold bro. On. Hey, somebody just put in the chat. Quavo, yeah, Quavo didn't get didn't get charged with it, what he did. So, did he uh, assault her though, or did he just take the bag? Ah, oh, come on now. <laughs> <laughs> but he's right though. It is it is a thin uh, line. Tomato, hey. tomato. <laughs> yeah, like tomato, tomato. So, do you think Salon should have got charged? Keep it G. I'm just saying, if they were to charge Diddy, they might as well charge her too. Fuck it devil's advocate but look the only the only difference is between the diddy and solange did solange put hands on him yeah but with kicking her and dragging her and shit like that solange didn't, didn't treat uh jay's like a hoe you're like right, that though i could have right. sworn she kicked the nigga she for sure that nigga for damn, so. <laughs> i do remember <laughs> i gotta be watching the video I, in the air, bro. I said that girl <laughs> yeah. she for sure had her knees up bro she definitely, yeah. I bet she definitely got some good shit. She got that good, good. And was she, what it, was the story like? She was kind of teeing on Beyonce. Oh, it's the rumor that because he cheated. Yeah, she, that's the. You will never know the whole story. Some people say he was just flirting or some shit. With Solange? No, nah, with, nah, with somebody shit. else at the party. With Becky with the good hair. Becky with the good I hair. Thought it was Rich, I thought it was Rich Roy. Ain't that demo work? No, she was tired of him treating, tired of him treating um, her sister uh -huh. like trash, so she had to check that nigga on the motherfucking um, elevator. Damn, there's baby mom. Yeah. I thought that was his old work. Hmm. Interesting. Jay Z sound like Drake. Whose baby mom was Jay Z flirting with? Damn, I man. thought that the incident happened over damn dad's baby mom with Richard Rod with the spine shit. Oh, I ain't know. I Hey, but if if a woman did do um, a dude like did 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 Cassie, what what do y'all think the public would say, or what do you think the police would do? You saw it. I'll say that again, bro. If somebody the way Diddy did Cassie, if like if that was reversed, if a woman Ray Rice, bro, like Ray that, Rice. 
Yeah, we bought that up. Hey, what was oh, the Ray name? Rice has ass whooped like that? No, Ray, Ray Rice whooped the female. You don't remember when Ray Rice got <laughs> in the elevator with the bitch. female, Shit. but he got out the elevator by himself. Oh, yeah, he, nah, he dragged her ass out, didn't he? Well, conscious. I meant consciously. Oh, right, right. <laughs> in that bag. He still drug her ass out. He did. Out he knocked her ass out. out. He, he did drag her. Yeah, I do remember that. But I was saying, hey, who what, was in what? that bag that Diddy was trying to get? What the fuck? I, I think them was just her bags. I think she I think was just trying just to stop clothes. her from leaving type shit. Bro, think about it. She might have with the pink dope. Think about it. Yep, we're leaving with that Tusi. With a towel. Hey, the nigga, the nigga was butt naked while he was doing that, bro. Exactly. He only he threw the towel, towel on to chase her down the, the hall. It was like it looked like she tried to sneak out while the nigga was in the shower or something. He, I, he I wasn't found, wet. Bro. He wasn't wet. Oh, no, they said he was nah, sleeping. Woke up. It. They said he was sleeping. Woke up. Oh, I thought she walked in on him. No, nah, they nah. said he socked her ass up. And then uh, gave her a black eye, and then so while he was asleep, she tried to get away, and that's when he did all that. So she put the hoodie on. She put all them clothes on, boy. I was, you know boy. she had them big ass shades on. She, she was trying to sneak out. Mm -hmm. Did anybody feel different about Cash? Cash since this video came out because I know a lot of people thought that she was just like on the money grab type shit. Anybody like believe her more? How simple the fuck? Cause like a lot of people were tearing their ass down when this shit first came. Oh, it's pretty dumb. I mean, I think you know what it is. I think people just question it. I don't think a lot of people was trying to tear it down. They were just like, they was definitely saying that what? she did it just for the money. No, it because, was because of how long I'm not gonna say it wasn't. Yeah, because of how long it took to say that it was for the money. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, it's like a lot of people did did do that. Like, just automatically, it's like, oh, she she lying. But then also, people were just like, just question it, like. Did it really happen, or is that money grab due to the fact how long ago it was? You feel me? And it just made like a question mark in the, in the sky. Now I don't think a lot of people were just saying like they don't believe it, but a hundred percent. But I think people just, I don't know. Me personally, I didn't believe. I didn't believe the rape. I believed everything but the rape part. But now that it's the video that came out, I believe the rape part too. Yeah, a lot of people had shit to say. Nah, but I could just tell by how everybody was acting different towards Diddy. And everybody was just distant from him. You see, you know. That's my point, exactly. And, and you exactly. Hear, and all the speculations. You, you know, I heard comedians, comedians that's not even, that was upcoming and was like, yo, what's one thing I need to know uh, about this industry? Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stay away from Diddy. <laughs> yeah, like, that's not, I don't give a fuck what you say. If a nigga joking and a nigga was serious about that shit, my nigga. That's a red flag, right? That's a sign right there. Man. Yeah, I seen that. I seen that shit. But um, yeah, a lot of people was kind of tearing her down, and I think with this evidence, even people like Slim Thug apologized or you know took back whatever he said. You know, it's people that for sure are standing on that they 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 didn't believe her. <coughs> a lot of a lot of Diddy friends didn't say something, didn't say nothing, but their sign is full back. Yeah, the silence like spoke say, volumes like a lot. Yeah, and, and, and also, everybody stayed Hold on, distant. one mic on whack real quick. What you mean to say, nigga, a lot of his friends ain't been standing with him, period. No, that's what I'm saying. The fact that they're not standing with him, that says a lot to me. Like, that they're not, they not defending him, like, you know what I'm saying? That's why I said that's No, just that's, just, that's just the industry. They fuck with you when they fuck with you, and they ain't gonna fuck with you when they ain't supposed to. Yeah. It's because they industry party don't mean they're a friend. The only ones gonna fuck with you like that is a friend. Got you. Free Keefy D. Hey, what the hell let me? You ain't said that for nothing. What the hell let me? Stay tuned. Pay attention. Free Keefy D. Lord. Key fee, key fee, key fee, key fee. Key fee. <laughs> hey, if y'all don't realize, key fee. It, key if y'all didn't realize, like after he went, he went to jail, that's when everything came out. Think about it. Oh, this nigga right here, weird. Send that nigga over to the ADHD. Take your ass next door to ADHD. You know what I'm saying? Don't come over here, no goddamn weird ass conspiracy theorists like that. Bang, know what he talking about. Now you want to mix Keefy D 
like he has something to do with beating cats. <laughs> now I even want to say Keefe D has something to do with that. Next thing you know, Keefe D didn't kill Tupac. Now he didn't beat Cassie. He didn't kill Suge. He didn't kill the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Y'all putting all this shit on Keefe D. You know what I'm saying? That's why it's free Keefe D. You know what I'm saying? I've been watching El Chapo all night, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Number three and four. All night I've been watching El Chapo, nigga. You talking about that show? Yeah, I've been watching El Chapo all night. What you fucked up with? What you talking? You missing a point. Free Keefe D. Keefe. They freed El Chapo. Freed El Chapo through the tunnels. Keefe. Hey, Wack, your post, night. I was dying laughing. We was like, I lied. Now I'm on all y'all asses. <laughs> like, you like the next, mm -hmm. what'd you say, 72 hours or some shit? You See, on everybody else? This morning, one o'clock this morning, I sent. Bob That's what I was gonna ask you about. <laughs> I swear to God, I saw Come that shit. I said, "Oh out. shit!" And then you said, "Tron is network." It gave it away. I said, "Oh shit!" That's free key PD. Key, 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 key. You know what? We need to put up a poll. Should we free key PD? Yes or no? We need to put up a poll. We need to put up a poll. Should we free? Mm -hmm. Keefe D or not. So he could do that show on the Tronics Network? Keefe, 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 Keefe. You know. It's a good play right now, bro. You know, in history, lately, it's always been the blood that been doing something for a crip in this industry. You know what I'm saying? Speak on it, partner. Always been a blood. Been doing something for a crip in this industry. You know. Um, and I, I ain't been liking the fact that these niggas ain't been hating enough. You know, I, I ain't been feeling the hate. You know, you niggas is slowing down on your hate. I said, yo, whack. Are they slowing down on the hate because they starting to like you? Or are they slowing down on the hate Cause you ain't been giving them enough to hate about. So I sat back and I thought about it. I said, yeah. Free Keefe D. <laughs> Free Keefe D. Now where they hate you cause you're saying it or would they hate you more if you did it? I said, whack. They gonna hate you for saying it. Cause they gonna be like, why cuz playing about that shit? And that's what, you know what I'm saying? He need to stay out of crip business. And you know what? I've been known for talking about shit that ain't my business. But the first Crip tell me I need to stay out of Crip business, or if I even start thinking it's a Crip that's telling this Paru to stay out of Crip business, you're going to make me make it my business. Free Keefe D. Keefe, Keefe, Keefe. Keefe. Shout out to QCP Films coming. QCP Films coming in collab with 100 ENT. Um, you guys stay tuned. We got the Tronics Network right now popping though. You know, right now. You know, I, I, I preach and practice the octopus method of things. You know, not just an arm, but tentacles on the arm several tentacles on the arm i'm going to fuel the hate my mission is to give them reason to hate more i don't like when you guys are liking me like that ain't been enough storms outside 
want my fucking name written on the side of the wall, the side of the freeway. Cross the fuck out. <laughs> so I think I came up with a way to make them hate me a little more. I'm going to get up this morning, work out. I'm going to go down there and pick my Rolls Royce up that I forgot was down there at the shop. And I'm going to drive on over there and have a conversation with my bail bondsman. I'm finna go get Keefy. I just said I'm going to have a conversation with my bail bondsman. That's all I said. It's a famous crip in the L.A. County Jail. But then there's a famous crip in the Las Vegas County Jail. I have been prone to get people out of both. Wouldn't be the first crip I got out of Las Vegas County Jail for a serious offense. Free Blueface. He got a violation. They might not let me get him. Yeah, tonight might be the night. Well, go up top and vote, y'all. Go up top and vote. Should we free Keefe D? What's up, little lateral? Hey, little lateral. Yo. I don't know why y'all acting like y'all ain't see that every that Ebony IG post. Oh, you niggas seen it. See, the more y'all ignore it, I know you niggas seen it. Stalker motherfuckers. See, you niggas is stalkers when y'all don't say nothing about it. And when you don't say nothing about it, you're letting it resonate on your mind. Then they get to growing. Then you get these fucking thoughts. Then them thoughts fucking drive you to doing some other shit. Next thing you know, you got a fucking mask on and you're leaning outside the fucking house and you're looking and peeking in the window and you're saying, there she go right there. Or you can be a nigga like me and say, nigga, you know you saw that goddamn IG post, little lateral. They say Silly Jamal was outside a window with a boom bus. Oh. <laughs> Yo. In the rain. I love that lateral, though. That's dope. That's dope. I knew exactly what you was talking about. That's straight chosen, up. Chosen. Close your lips. Why is your lips sitting there parted about eight foot of an inch? Close them damn lips, Chosen. There you go. F gang, why the spies sending me content on you, grabbing your crotch like you got some nuts? They say, why F gang thinks you got some nuts? <laughs> I don't know nothing about that. You want to see the content, Joe? Uh, F gang? Uh, it's probably something I posted. I don't. If it's what I think it is, that that's not what I was doing though. Man, they sending me the content. They say F gang grabbing like she got some nuts. You was serious too, F Gang. <laughs> you was like in the motherfucking OG LL Cool J Dairy Vet stands. I hope I didn't go before your time. Yeah, I don't know. You know the song, F Gang? Nah, I don't know nothing about that. Bang. Remember the lyrics of the song, Bang? What's that? LL Cool J Dairy Vet. You a down south nigga. Back then, y'all was hating on them niggas because they was hating yeah, on y'all. So I understand. <laughs> <laughs> Dear Yvette, doom, doom, doom. Dear Yvette, that was on my radio. I'm bad. The Briscoe Hotel. What at that? 515. Y'all don't. <clears throat> you niggas don't know that? What the al- album cover was a boom box? Yeah, that's the. uh huh? oh, it, it. <clears throat> No rapper can rap quite like I can. I take a muscle bound man and put his face in the sand. Nigga, make it say go LL and do the WAP. Ebony, you do not know about the WAP. You too young. Too young to know about the WAP. I and know nothing patch. about the WAP. You don't know nothing about the WAP, the cabbage patch, the truth. Oh, oh I know pussy. the cabbage patch now. Roger, I know the Roger, cabbage Roger. patch. about the truth. You don't know nothing about none of them, nigga. Roger, Roger. Nah, I know about the crybaby and the cabbage patch, though. Nah, you don't know what's going on. <laughs> Shut your ass up, Santana. You wasn't even in your daddy's scrotum sack yet. You be quiet. You didn't come along till little Bow Wow or something. Now, fuck is going on in this goddamn bitch? This goddamn puff daddy, they finna bore. 
The worst is yet to come. Hey, we only had like 10 people to vote. Go up top and tap that link and vote. Should we free Keefy D or not? Yeah. I mean, you know, the goo been on some bullshit lately. You know what I'm saying? That's why I ain't been shouting y'all out, goo. Y'all ain't been participating. Chat numbers been down. Niggas ain't participating in the vote. It's cool, goo. You know, I know y'all think y'all got me in a chokehold. But I'm going to start going into private on you niggas. We're going to start having private morning shows. Since yeah. the goo, y'all striking on me, goo? Goo, y'all want some problems with what? What they do, whack? No, I fuck with y'all. I ain't scared. I'm talking to the goo. I ain't scared of you niggas down there. You niggas and niggas. I ain't scared of you niggas. Nigga, y'all been having my chat all low and all kind of shit like that, goo. I'm the first one to let the world know I ain't shit without my goo. You know what I'm saying? And what, what the goo do? The goo lay down on me. They stop chatting. They stop participating. You know what I'm saying? You know, I don't know what them niggas did up there, but what did Wack do to the goo? I show the goo love. I let people know we ain't shit without the goo, but the goo lay down on Wack. I come in, I want to see my chat numbers. That's all I got to go by. They didn't kill the hallway. You know what I'm saying? We two, three hundred. That's like two, three thousand a day. At least I can see. 1,500, 2,500, 1.9, 2.7 in my goo, but no. I looked out for one of y'all fellow goo mates yesterday. They was finna flame on sunshine up. What Wack do? Wack came in here and fake like he was talking to Reek and gave old sunshine a way out because somebody in the goo kept saying Wack. And my fucking Instagram DMs. Why I come from the goo? Can you look out for our girl Sunshine? She 50 years old. She don't know no better. She's stuck in her ways. And then the goo can't show up to me. Huh? Huh? The goo ain't got no love for Whack 100? Huh? Huh? The goo ain't got no love for Whack 100? <laughs> I knew he was going to huh? say that. Huh? The fuck going on? Y'all got my niggas, Clubhouse TV, the Shenanigans TV, White Gives TV. Y'all got me looking bad in front of my media team. The goo ain't got no love for Wack 100. Huh? It's all right, goo. It's all right, goo. It's all right. You know, I'm going to go to the trenches and start bring, giving me a new goo coming over here. Since y'all ain't fucking with me, let me come in any room today and my fucking chat is under 1K them as bars. Let me come in any room today and catch my chat under 1K. I'm taking my shit to privates. I'm going to get academics to come over here and we're going to a private since the goo on a trip. Because whack show love for the goo, but the goo ain't showing whack no love. And why are y'all gooing this to me? Why are y'all gooing me like this? Welcome to the 100 ET Morning Show with motherfucking whack 100. Hot topics. We got the motherfucking gang in here. Keep it GF gang. J.O. Lavish chosen. Bang. Bumpy. Ab Miss Collateral and Lateral. Silly Santana. She's drunk and sleeping. Don't even know it. Eric, SD motherfucking TV, Ray Gibbs TV, media team, my motherfucking right hand beast, my motherfucking homegirl Rosetta, Eric, bitch ass nigga, whack 100, I'm going to say his name because he on stage, Clubhouse TV, Chosen Fish, who the fuck are you, I ain't going to even lie, Shotty the Mac, I'm going to give you a shout out nigga, I don't know you like that yo, my man busy, sucker, simp ass nigga, crying by this motherfucking daddy, don't know <laughs> y'all want to hear that shit, go to late yeah, night, crying it. about his motherfucking daddy, all fucking night, so I just told a nigga, get a knife and slit your motherfucking, <laughs> I ain't going to say that, <laughs> Jesus, lucky, ECMD exposed. Kermit, the motherfucker, you always psych me out, and I thank you a bitch. I'm not calling you a bitch, but you keep a bitch on your PTR. Justin, what a why? DJ Punch 317. I don't know you, nigga. Don't make me get to know you in the wrong way. Von Kelly, Big Cash 702. Justin Farrell, at 85. Motherfucker Ray Nail, Inc. Sue Struggle, NB Jock. My main man, Trucker. Uh, what up? Trucker motherfucking Joe. Mass guy. They trucker Joe. You trying to be slick, nigga. All right.